As I see it, today's technology is being integrated into our lifestyles. Laptop, desktop, MP3 player, PS2, digital cameras, television. It's very possible that you use at least one of these a day, especially if you're in your teens. Take this home for example. Here is the living room. Cold, crispy, crunchy, crackle, pulsating electrical The dining room. It's just so automatic. My piece of personal plastic. It's the bedroom of three daughters. What catches your eye? Or rather, what grabs your interest? The couch or bed where you could doze off or read a book or sit with someone to talk? Or that PlayStation on the dresser and the computers on the desks? Most of you probably thought those computers and that PlayStation looked like fun. They are. Very few who have picked up a video game or a computer thought it was boring. Have you ever heard someone say, why play Gears of War or Halo when I have this Monopoly set? Probably not, and definitely not from a kid. It probably gives several hours of gaming either way, but Monopoly isn't quite as enrapturing as those 3D graphics. What about, I'd rather be playing Dead Space right now? Ever heard that before? Especially when the offer being extended is an exciting session of Yahtzee or Bingo. That isn't particularly a problem, is it? No, indeed not. A world could use some spice to give the blandness of ordinary life a little flavor. However, too much spice can leave a bad taste. Don't know what I'm talking about? Then think. What happens when gaming in free time becomes gaming for days? That statement of, I'd rather be playing Dead Space is suddenly pushing aside family time, job hours, dinner, showering, and if it gets severe enough, cause drug addiction. There have been documented cases where someone gets so addicted to their gaming or computer that it starts to disrupt their lives and ruin their health. Technological addictions need counseling, which costs money that can be better spent otherwise. Personally, I like computers and video games. But there are limits that need to be put in place. Continue to add flavor to your entertainment, but keep in mind that the real world is more important and the digital realm is not where you can permanently escape to.